Hi, welcome to the RJ Machinery Showroom. Let's get your demo started on the Altendorf F45 Elmo Drive. So here we've got the F45 Elmo Drive. This is the flagship control system from the Altendorf Group. This machine is well known in the industry, has been on the market for many, many years. Altendorf, 111 years of manufacturing sliding table saws alone. Nothing else, they are the experts. So as you can see from this machine, We've got a 3.4 meter sliding table. This is our stock specification Elmo drive. We've got the duo CNC fence, extension on the cross slide, air table, vacuum clamping, laser lines. We've got the capacity to put a 550 mil saw blade. We've got a three axis scoring unit and we've even got an inbuilt, inbuilt toolbox where we can store spare blades and tooling. Everybody knows and loves the Altendorf for the sliding table system. This machine's no different. This is the double dumbbell roller system, working off a set of sub rollers with two hardened steel rollers built into the bed. Each of these tables are precision built, each unique to the machine that it's being placed onto. Hours and hours of time are taken to make these tables. They're precise, smooth, and reliable. We have machines that are 20, 30 years old with this sliding table system that we can bring back and feel like brand new. As you can see on this machine, we've got a in-feed support roller which is rising and lowering as we open it and close it. It just sits away there underneath the bed and the bed just covers it when not in use. When in use, if we're ripping some heavy materials or need extra support, we can bring that table back up to bed level. This machine's got a clipboard, laser line, obviously, rising and falling of the guard without any locking handles. We've got quick release of the hood from 45 degree hood to the narrow guard. And that can quickly be taken off and put back in place, ready for its next job. When we come onto the control system, we can see the main menu. So with this machine having full axis control, we can see positions one and two for the crosscut fence, stop one and two, rise and fall of the saw blade, tilt of the saw blade, and position of the rip fence. Each of these axes can be set up individually, and then set to work all at exactly the same time. While in red, they're not in position, and when we press start, the machine will start working. Saw blade adjusting to the set position. Height correcting. Flip stop one and two on the duo fence, automatically positioning. And the really clever thing about this machine is everything is automatically compensating. Everything is positioned and each axis is automatically compensated for the other. So as the blade tilts to 25 degrees, the rip fence knows to move out to allow for the angle. As does the height, the blade will go up to reposition for its former angle or former position. Once we're inside the main menu, we can then go on to a sub menu which has different applications. Features such as grooving and concealed cuts, incremental grooving, bevel cut with overmeasure, and a calculator for compound mitres. 
We can also import cutting lists to this machine and we've got a function for saw blade management which is ideal when you can range from anywhere from a 300 blade up to a 550 blade. Each blade can be stored in the system along with its scoring blade. Along with geometrical shapes and program functions, this machine also has a special feature which is the vacuum table. This allows us to secure the workpiece on the sliding table while in cut without having to apply extra pressure or worry that the material is going to move while in cut. And we can configure the vacuum table per the panel size. Each of these pods are adjustable and we can select the ones that we require to be turned on. Once we've selected the pods that we require, we can see on the cover down here and we can turn them on and off by this remote. At this stage, this panel is fixed to the bed and can be turned off again, pressing the second feature. Along with the vacuum clamping, we also have an air cushion table for any delicate material or any very heavy material. Yeah. Where from? Just from there. Along with the vacuum table, we also have. Along with the vacuum table, on the bed we have air cushion table which is perfect for any high gloss material, any material at risk of scratching, or anything very heavy. It can support very heavy material. The laser cutting line works very well with the vacuum clamping. As you can see, if you've marked a line along the board, we can position it with the laser, and then use the vacuum clamps to clamp onto the bed without setting up any fences or scales. This machine has on off switches mounted to the end of the sliding table and to the controller. This particular machine has been equipped with a three axis scorer. So from the main menu we can select the scorer symbol which brings the scorer into position then allowing us to adjust all aspects of the scoring unit. We can adjust it laterally, we can adjust it in its height, and we can adjust it in its width through the control system. Also, when changing from a small blade to a large blade, instead of having to completely remove the scorer, we can press this button here, which sees the scorer disappear under the cast table. Now we've opened up the whole saw blade area allowing for a large 550mm saw blade to be attached, giving us a 204mm depth of cut. So we can turn the machine on from the control panel here, or we can turn it on from the sliding table. Once the machine's running, we've got infinitely variable speed control, where we can turn it the speed up and down. While the machine's working. Or we can have presets as per the size of the blade. We can also adjust on the fly, adjust in position while the machine's running. This machine's really operator friendly. Anyone can jump on it, set it up and use it. It's quick to change over. Each axis has a back button, so we can always remember where we last came from. <laughs>